So it's uh, a sunny Tuesday afternoon, June 16th, here on Dunn Street, uh, about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And I wanted to give uh, everyone an update on how the window restoration project is going. It's pretty exciting stuff. So uh, I'll walk you around the west wall, north wall, and the steeple, and you have a look. Hopefully this works. So an update on the window restoration project. Um, there's your Dunn Street door entrance. We come along here and this is the start of it at the south end of the sanctuary. This is, you're looking at the west wall. So all of these windows here, we had to take the tempered glass off, which was protecting them. And underneath, uh, the condition of these windows was, it was almost dire. Uh, it was a lot of uh, chipping away of old paint and then sanding it all down priming it and uh, painting two coats of paint on it. So I hope that this uh, video does it justice. It's just beautiful. It's so crisp and white and you can see there up top too, the spires have yet to be done. They'll all be done as well. I'm filming on a Tuesday afternoon. It's about 3.30 in the afternoon. It's a beautiful, beautiful sunny day. It's a bit windy. So then we come over to the steeple and you can see here, going all the way up, they had to remove the bird netting. And then uh, everywhere where you see white, it has been painted. And again, it had to be scraped, sanded, primed, and painted. So uh, you'll see soon how high up the boys are in the, uh, in the bucket lift. So that's the south side of the steeple. And uh, as well as cameras on the west side of the steeple here as we come along hopefully this isn't too bumpy for you to be looking at I'll just stop and up we go you can see the guys in the bucket on the left way up there that's pretty high up it's about 65 to 70 feet up in the air they had to stop working on it a couple of days ago because the wind was too it was too blustery and they were, and you get moved around in that bucket and you could bang against the steeple so they had to come down they lost an afternoon of work there coming back down as we come around to the front the north side this is just wonderful um, the north side of the steeple starting at the bottom with those two windows all finished and clean going all the way up and you can see here that's where they're working on today way up high on the louvers up at the top just amazing work these people are doing and uh and then here's the front this looks absolutely gorgeous uh so the very top round window was not um was not part of this project because it had been done before but the uh, left and right windows you can see the one on the left is finished actually uh, uh, it's only primed so far it will be painted uh, tomorrow the one on the right is not quite done yet and then the arch over our front door is metal so that'll be done uh, it, this is all actually going to be finished by Friday of this week and here I'm right in front of this big uh, this is the big truck that operates boom moving past the truck um, to the uh, east side of the north wall hard to see the two two uh, windows up there hidden in behind the leaves there we had a fair bit of wood rot and so we had to replace some sills and some trim and that was done over the weekend just past and uh, I've seen pictures of it. It's just amazing, the, uh, the wood uh, workmanship. I guess they, they call it Dutchman. Really, really top-notch work. And so that has been done. And then here on the east side, which is our uh, going into the Memorial Garden, we have another lift bucket here. Pat's not in it right now. But we have, you can see just, uh, you see the one window there that I'm pointing at? Uh, it's a smaller window just below the bucket. And then it's hard to see because of the leaves or the, the branches, but there's three more windows up there plus um, a peak. And all of that has been done as well. It's just so 
it just looks so crisp so white so fresh it's just wonderful and then of course next year uh, will be the entire east wall which you can see down there in the uh, in the memorial garden so that's it so far it's going to all be done by friday and uh, we'll keep the pictures rolling